welcome back to Arsenal Online. Here is some of the latest news surrounding the Gunners. Arsenal signing Matt Turner announces when he will arrive in London. New England Revolution goalkeeper Matt Turner has already revealed when he will be officially signing for Arsenal this summer. The American goalkeeper will take part in half of the MLS campaign before travelling to North London later this month. He will become the Gunners' first signing of the summer transfer window and Turner spoke about this and when his last game for Revolution will be, revealing his official release from the club will be on June the 24th. He spoke to Fox Sports and said, I think the Revs have games on the 19th of June and then the 26th, so I'm available for the suction for the 19th, but not the 26th. My flight's booked for right after that game on the 19th. My wife is actually heading over three weeks before because she's due to give birth in July and she's got to get over there before that 36 week mark. So we're going to be split apart for three weeks. But she'll be over there, I'll get out there and then do my medical and get ready for a new season to start. Although there's still not been an official announcement from Arsenal, an initial 4.5 million deal has been agreed between the two clubs, with the fee climbing to 7.5 million with bonuses. The Gunners will look to confirm the deal when Turner officially moves to England, which, as he's now revealed, will be on, on or shortly after June the 19th. Turner isn't expected to be Arsenal's only signing this summer either, as Edu is planning to bring in plenty of additions for Mikel Arteta. Arsenal have agreed to sound Sao Paulo winger Marquinhos for a fee of £3 million. And other Arteta targets include City's Gabriel Jesus, with the Gunners confident of landing his signature. Gunners are also interested in signing Bologna left-back Aaron Hickey following his impressive performance in Serie A. Leicester midfielder Yuri Telemans is also a priority target with Arteta needing an experienced central midfield player. It's going to be a very busy window for the Gunners and a testing one too as they look to provide Arteta with a squad that can improve on last season's fifth placed finish. Matt Turner was largely a spectator for Friday night's 5-0 international win over Granada to kick off the CONCACAF Nations League. He kept his 13th clean sheet in his 18th appearance for the US men's national team. For Matt Turner, this move is a dream come true. He didn't get into football until he watched the 2010 World Cup when he was 16 years old. After the tournament, he began to follow the Premier League and became a fan of Arsenal and started to watch their matches at Arsenal supporters' preferred bars. He recalls, A lot of those gooners probably saw me at the bar and obviously had no idea who I was, which is pretty funny to think about now. Even after he began starring in the MLS, it looked unlikely that he would ever get the opportunity to move to Europe, never mind to one of the biggest clubs in the Premier League and the one he'd started supporting. Before Arsenal came calling, he said no European club had ever made an offer for him. He said, towards the end of last year, probably in November, my agent mentioned something about Arsenal getting in contact and having a bit of interest. He was like, there's this, this and this out there, a couple of teams in the championship, nothing that's going to hit the price that the Revs are going to want for you, but there's a ridiculously long shot that Arsenal are interested. You're on a list of probably five to eight goalkeepers that they could see themselves going for. That was his quote. A ridiculously long shot. 
Well, it now seems that the ridiculously long shot will be covering Aaron Ramsdale, as Bernd Leno is reportedly set to lead the club this summer. That's not bad for a player who didn't begin playing soccer until he was 14 years old. Thank you for watching our channel. Please subscribe and ring that bell for all the latest Gunners news.